The masked singer reveals identity of Anteater and Candelabra. Here are the celebrities under the costumes. Oh, here he comes. Watch out, boy, he'll chew you up. Oh, oh, here he comes. John Oates is an Anteater. Say it isn't so. John Oates, one half of the most successful rock duo of all time, Daryl Hall and John Oates, was revealed on Wednesday as the Anteater on The Masked Singer. Later, Keisha Cole was also unmasked as the Candelabra. The Oates' appearance comes at quite a coincidental moment. He and Hall have been in the news recently after a falling out and Hall's lawsuit over Oates' plan to sell his share of their joint venture. I can't really talk about it, Oates told Variety last week. I don't really want to talk about it. It's not why I'm here. I want to focus on the music and the masked singer. Things will work itself out and time will tell. Okay, we get it. He can't go for that. So let's talk about the masked singer. Dressing Oates up as an anteater was obviously a nod to the famed Hall and Oates song, Man Eater, and yet that obvious clue completely eluded the show's panelists. They knocked me down and tied my hands behind my back and told me I was going to be the anteater, Oates quipped. To be honest with you, when I saw the rendering of the costume, I didn't really care for it much, but I kind of just went with the flow. Then I realized, anteater, maniator. It was interesting that no one else picked up on that on the show. At least they didn't talk about it.